You're camping. You hear the clip-clop of horses' hooves. Who could be coming at this time of night? What are they doing this far in the forest? Then you see a silhouette of a horse and a man atop it. That man's not atop it. It's attached! It's a centaur! What is that centaur doing here? Why is it so buff in the chest area? How does it work out that muscle? Oh, it's attacking! Ah! I tweeted recently how do centaurs get such big pecs when push-ups are logistically impossible for them? And it actually kind of struck a chord. I got a lot of comments that were suggesting ways that a centaur could get big pecs. I want to go through a few of those. We'll kind of hash out if it is possible for a centaur to get big pecs. This is maybe the dumbest topic I've ever <laughs> covered. People suggested shake weights, uh, steroids, implants, anachronistic. They didn't exist when centaurs were big. Somebody said pull-ups, centaur could do pull-ups. Well, number one, it's a, it's a back exercise. Try lifting a horse in addition to your own body. Up to the pole! Get up and turn. Oh my god, oh my back is broken. At Bleak Swan commented, props punching scrubs with hide helmets on. It's only a little bit of a chest exercise. It's mostly shoulders. I like the idea that centaurs could get magic muscle augmentation. They don't feel comfortable enough living in their own skin. What kind of social standards would that be? My buddy Joseph Allen suggested that maybe centaurs get those big pecs from from b-boy moves, centaur b-boy moves, like break dancing. That's an interesting idea. I like that idea. You would need to start young though, because if you try to start break dancing as an adult centaur, you're gonna throw your shoulder out immediately. You can't lift an entire horse body with just the muscles that you've you've naturally accrued throughout life. So if you start as a young centaur and then you've got the weight of like a, a baby horse, which averages about 100 to 200 pounds at birth, you could grow as a horse and grow the muscles for breakdancing at the same time so that when you're an adult, you can do your spin kicks and your flips and stuff. Although you would think that we would see a lot more horse dancing if they had those skills. It's possible that genetics maybe leads to a, a centaur having big pecs. It's possible, you know, that, that uh, farmers, centaur farmers could have selectively bred centaurs for big pecs through generations until now, centaurs have big pecs. Just they're born with that kind of predisposition to big pecs. It does beg the question, What's up with these creepy farmers? At Jason Salentis commented, Bow and arrow work. Brilliant. Centaurs are known for their bow and arrow stuff, and that kind of muscle workout is just, that's perfect for building a chest. I'm glad we got to the, to the bottom of this. I'm glad we settled this. If you guys have any comments for other things that you think centaurs could have used to to build out their chest muscles, you can leave them in the comments. Do centaurs sleep standing up and then just like the upper torso just kind of slumps over <laughs> weirdly? <laughs> and, and subscribe. Subscribe to m my videos. <laughs> It'd be hilarious if the top half of the centaur didn't get to pick where the bottom half walked around. <laughs> and like this video, please. Uh, if you didn't like it, then, I mean, way to go for watching this long. I, I think that's impressive. Don't hit the unlike, though. You don't need to do that. In fact, what's the harm of hitting the like button anyway, you know what I mean? Anyway, uh, thanks for watching, guys. Bye. Love you. I want a centaur-drawn carriage. <laughs>